Hello again. Today we are back with another car audio system. It's a two-way system from Stag Italy. This is an entry-level system. So let's see what we got. The packaging is new from Stag. It's a white box. The model is ST650C. We have the manual and this is a two-way system. In the two-way system we have a 6.5 inch mid-range woofer by Steg from Italy. We will get back to it a bit later. The set also comes with tweeters and crossovers. So let's begin with the woofer. The woofer is paper cone with textile fibers. It can handle maximum power of 40 watts. The impedance is 3.6 ohms. Frequency range 60 Hz to 4000 Hz. The sensitivity is 88 dB. And other parameters can be found on the manual. Mounting diameter is 147 millimeters and the overall weight is 1.5 kilograms. As you can see we have reinforced terminals with clip-on and screw, some proper ventilation of the voice coil and a really nice magnet next to the tweeter. The tweeter is transparent silk it's a silk dome tweeter. The impedance of the tweeter is also 3.6 ohms. Maximum power handling is 25 watts. Frequency range is 1500 Hz to 22000 kilohertz. And sensitivity is 90 dB voice coil is 1 inch and mounting diameter is 41 millimeters. It also comes with a crossover network. Uh, the manual doesn't state what crossover point the crossover network uses but I believe it will be something around 2.5 kilo, kilohertz. It's a really nicely designed crossover with inputs, buffer outputs and tweeter outputs. Also this set can be used with active crossovers or a DSP. Now we will make a measurement to see the true parameters of the woofer and the tweeter. So again with the tape rolls, lifting the speaker higher up to allow the ventilation. Using the DACT by Dayton Audio measurement tool. And now you will hear a sweep. Test has been concluded. So as I can see, we have a really we have really good parameters. Uh, the measurement shows that uh, the impedance is 3.7 ohms, which is really the same as manufacturer states. The FS resonant frequency of the woofer is 49.8 Hz, so it's 50 Hz. Q 
QTS is 0 0.39 so also the same as manufacturer states so overall the parameters what manufacturer states are true and I believe that this is a really good woofer okay so now we will test the tweeter again you will hear a sweep so the manufacturer doesn't state uh, a lot of parameters on the manual the impedance is 3.5 ohms which is similar to the manual manual shows 3.6 ohms so that's really precise the resonant frequency of this tweeter is 1720 Hertz and QTS is 0 0.88 so this also shows that uh, this tweeter is also a really good one and manufacturer doesn't lie about his specs so now we will make a RTA measurement to see the speaker frequency response as you can see the microphone is hanging from upside it's one centimeter from the cone so let's begin and from the graph we can see that this woofer climbs up from 40 Hertz really steadily uh, the frequency response is really linear till 5 kilohertz then it starts to slope down like it should because the manufacturer states that frequency range is from 60 to 4 so now let's do the same measurement for the tweeter now we will do the same test for the tweeter uh, just now the frequency test will start at 1 kilohertz to not damage the tweeter because it can't handle the lower frequencies so we will start at 1 kilohertz so the test has ended and from the graph I can see that the response of the tweeter is really really linear so it should be a really really good tweeter it goes all the way up to 20 kilohertz and from what I can see the whole curve uh, fits into plus and minus 3 or 4 dB so it's a really really good tweeter well you can see from the graph yourself I really would recommend this tweeter my overall verdict uh, well test really don't lie and from tests you can see that it really passed all those tests with flying colors I really recommend this set for the price range it's really not that expensive but it's built with really good materials the tweeter housing is metal the woofer basket is aluminum tweeter crossovers has really good components inside them so I really recommend this set uh, in my other videos uh, we will compare this set to other sets from Eton or audio system but till now this is a really really good two-way system and I think we will need to try to mount them somewhere and to have a listen so this will be it for today I hope you will subscribe and stay tuned for my other videos see ya